Welcome back. We're now doing part three. We're in this another puzzle room. I want to go over here, I pick this up, L1 to call one over, and you'll both pick it up together. And this will create a beam of light, which will light that silver ball. Hit the mirror, mirror, and it will go there. And now you want to move them, um, move them over to this wall, and then make your way up as Harry or Ron or whoever. I don't think it matters much, but Harry's a more agile character in this game, so he'd like to do it. No, not that way, Harry, you silly boy. Come on, come on, trying, you silly boy. I really don't like the look of that big eye on the wall up there. Oh, just going, you Ron. Oh. Yeah. Oh, card. Checking time. Let's see what this one is. It's annoying. They don't tell you what they are. If they did in the last two games, or the PS1 games anyway, not this one, or any of the PS2 ones actually, come to think of it. Quidditch still. Roderick Plumpton, ah, oh, he was in the first game as well. Sick of England Quidditch team. Hold the British record for something like that. Three and a half seconds, I think it is. Don't know, I know that, but meh. Rightio, so around here, collect the beans as well, because they're always useful. Use those at Fair George's shop later on in the game. And now you want to step onto this mirror and aim the light at the Ugh. ball over there. I think you need to shine the light beam onto something. Well done, one. Three gold stars. And that will hit the eye. The beam of light will. That will close the eye and open up those two letters there. How absolutely smashing. So up here. Up here. Right, get my up here as well, might have changed to Ron. But because he's slower, Ron's actually more easy to control. <laughs> Harry runs really fast and so and so. So yeah, Harry's a more agile character, Ron can find sick of passageways. Ron is a smaller so she can get under small gaps, and also she's clever so she learns the most spells. Ron learns one of his own spells, Harry learns two and Hermione learns four. One which had to buy. Another puzzle? Oh great. <laughs> One hates thinking. What you want to do here, if you look at this device here, the ratchet, is you want to go over to the ratchet with a character and basically bendo it. What's in here? Target it, Keep bendo going. it. Three times will do it. And also at the, um, at the back, there are some um, hidden areas, or secret areas in fact. One there, nothing in there, that one. One of them's got a. what are they called? A chest in a card. All of them's got beans in it. Sounds like we've got some company. Oh, it's pixies! Oh, quite straightforward. Give them a couple of good dependos, you'll be fine. Anything else? No, 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 no. One of these has got pigs, you know. Hope it's not this one. That one's empty. Oh, it's not. There's pixies that appear. Evil pixies. Right, do, we, do we get it? Do we get it? Ah, do we get it or not? I don't know. Oh well. Screw that pixie, I see. Oh, Harry's firing up there. Well, right, we'll go up there later. Wait a minute, actually. This has got the cards in, men. And this will complete your Quidditch collection Good. of the cards. Part three, we've done the Quidditch collection, it's not bad at all. So, and of course, for collecting each of the uh, sections of the cards, you get an extra card, and then you also get something new for the characters. So like Harry's now got increased stamina. Babarus Bragg enters the Golden Snidget into Quidditch in Part 69. This looks like Santa Claus with new clothes. Uh, or newish. Anyway, what am I talking about? Those were old clothes. Right. Harry's endurance has increased. Harry, Not stamina, endurance. Yes, Harry, what about you? Because he's add on, he can climb up long ropes. Alright then, I'll stay down here. <laughs> and uh keep watch. Yeah. Poor old one. Make sure you don't fall off. <laughs> Thanks for your concern, Ron. As if he wants to do anything else. That's he got rid of his pixies, but 
annoy you. I will leave one to do those. Come along, you get the beans. Whoa, that was close. I'll go get a bean. Beans are useful. Beans are cool. And down here. Then you want to uh, drop down to this bit here. And. Whoop, or jump. In nice case. Jump is more adventurous than just dropping down. <gasps> oh dear. More than high becomes separated. Deliberately, as you'll see in a while. Right know here. that help is always at hand for every true mischief maker. Oh, mischief. Mischief, mischief, mischief. Mischief, smile on the name. Actually, it's Peter and Zep. Don't tell when I said that. Anyway, in this an chest is an owl treat for Harry. Which means I mean owl nearby. Oh my god, it's a book again! Oh my god. Those evil books. This time it will send papers at you. You have to use Expelliarmus to dodge to um, dodge them. Uh, repel them, that's the word. Back at them. Back at them. The book. Bloody hell, I can't speak today. <sighs> oh, mum's bought me some tea. Oh, lovely. Uh, portrait. What is the password? Oh, how very posh. Let's go around here, up to this balcony or ledge. And you want to go up to this podium and call Hedwig. Which, in case you don't know, is Harry's owl. Here she is. Beautiful mm. thing. So I've got the owl treats. Just feed her the owl treats. Mm. And now she will do whatever you want, including to kill herself. No, not really. <gasps> Out there's the map! Well, I guess Hedwig will have to go and get it. Whee! So, hold out to fly. Use directions. Get the map. There you go. And now that you've got the map, make your way back to Halley. Oh, I can't go down here annoyingly. Otherwise, I'll probably just fly off and see how far we can get away from Harry. It's quite a nice decision playing Hedwig. You can do races with the owls as well, which is quite cool. Anyway, I'm bored of flying with Hedwig now. Let's get back to Harry. Here you go, Harrykins. Yep. I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. How does he have to say that? I mean, why to say that? <sighs> oh, a challenge shield. Those of you who played the first game will know about challenge shields. Get your points. So go over there, get the points, and say the password. Might be useful to say in front of the portrait, oh, Harry. Please step through, young sir. Oh, please! Step through. <laughs> What's he trying to be? Like a pervert or something like that? Anyway, sneaking sections. In this game, we have knights that have, like, vision. And if you get in their vision, they will, like, get annoyed and make loud noises in fact, attention. You'll be in trouble. And, oh my god, I've been an idiot and I've gone down the wrong way. Okay, my bad. So you have to go around this way, it seems. And, uh, press the button, and the door will open. Or the gate, or whatever it is. Oh dear, my, my memory's quite blank today. I had a German test today, I actually speak loads of Deutsch. Fun, fun, fun. Anyway, so run back round here as far as you can, get through this dorm, and you're done. Second room now. you notice there's a little map in the left hand corner. That's, uh, Oh, damn, I've been spotted. Ah, oh, eagerly. Uh, well. So, avoid being seen, yep. Those blue, 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 blue dots on the map are enemies, or things that can see you. Bean in there, great. One bean in one whole chest. Doesn't really need that much guarding, it's only a bean. Anyway, what you can do here is step into the shadows. You don't get seen. Make your way along the wall. Quite straightforward. Come along here. Come as far as you can. And there's a knight here. Make your way down here. And. Bet seen by the knight. Damn it! Right, get back to here. Because it'll be at the start of the room. You want to go into this shadow bit here. Shadowy bit. Wait for the knight to. Knight's vision to pass you. And then go into here. And. Oh, what the hell? We're going to here. 
What's in here then? Some chests, I'm guessing they have beans in them. Oh well, though, beans are useful. Yeah, there's only one bean. Bit of a waste. No, 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 no. So we've nearly finished this level actually. Or this mission, I suppose. There's one more room in here we have to get through. But we shall do that next time. So look, there's Snake down there actually. You have to be careful with him. And we'll do this next time. See ya!